yeah hi we are from SVS embedded the project title name is called Bluetooth controlled robot using Android mobile phone so here I'm using an uh, Arduino Uno R3 and one HC05 Bluetooth module I am using and I am using uh, two DC motors those are 60 rpm DC motor there is no specification but I purchased 60 rpm uh, I am using two adapters one adapter for the Arduino and the Bluetooth 9 volts it is converted into the 5 volts and I am using a 5 volts for the Bluetooth RX and TX RX it is connected with the fourth and the TX it is connected with the fifth pin 9 uh, 9 volts adapter 9 volts uh, battery it is connected with the L293D quadrupole HBG driver IC for the DC motor controlling purpose so L293D it can uh, operate with 4 volts to um, I think maybe 30 to 40 volt so here 9 volts uh, it is eligible for the L293D and uh, here that these are operating with uh, uh, 60 rpm motors it can operate uh, uh, 5 to 12 volts we are taking 9 volts of power supply and we are giving 5 volts input to the L293 you can give uh, 1 volt to up to 5 volt it can accept and 1 volt 2 volt 3 volt whatever it may be and we are giving the 5 volts input to the L293 and 6 7 for the one side and 2 3 for other side so forward backward left right and stop so here i'm using uh, two ad uh, two adapters so batteries sorry this is 9 volt 500 milliamp and this is 9 volts 500 milliamp and one for you okay and other for you okay so why i'm using two batteries means it's 60 rpm motor it is going for a slow and it is consume more power that's why i'm using for these two dc motor and l293 for one battery and here uh, arduino board and uh, bluetooth module for one battery and i'm i'm giving for the extra two batteries okay extra two batteries for external we are going to present in external viva so we required i'm giving two 9 volts batteries as a fresh okay so uh, let us coming into the L uh, Arduino you know R3 board so we are using the uh, 2367 for the L293D one for one motor and other side one motor here SC05 Bluetooth module so one to one communication and it is working under 9600 bits per second and it is a trans receiver module okay so here the back side is uh, uh, 60 RPM motors I am using okay and this is a free wheel okay so here uh, first of all uh, we are downloading one bluetooth app application uh, that application is blue controlled application we are downloading we download from the google play store okay now i'm going to give the power supply okay so first of all first of all you need to go for the settings settings so open the bluetooth bluetooth on bluetooth on so search the device 03 paired it 1 2 3 4 ok it's couldn't pay uh, pin pin number is wrong okay. one two three four okay okay bluetooth nearby bluetooth uh, devices were found okay bluetooth is paired so you need to go for the blue control clear it open the bluetooth and here you need to click it open the bluetooth there is a options 
options here four options connect 103 bluetooth controlled ok ok forward backward left right stop forward right back uh, left back stop so those are 60 rpm motors uh, it can go it can go slowly so you can use a 100 rpm motor or 300 rpm motor it can go very fast okay as per the application for the uh, robot control uh, using arduino android app so they asked me to develop this project so i developed this project using arduino uno r3 board and bluetooth module and one l293d driver i see and this is a google play store it's a free app blue control app so you can go for multiple actions uh, called uh, front to light a b c d e f g h okay you can go for multiple operations it's a easy application anyone can use this project simple project there is around uh, a 5 to 10 lines code bluetooth will re read the data and uh, it can for check the value uh, u d left right l r c these are the values we are passing and that bluetooth module is receiving those values and it is performing the operation i'm thanking you if there is any doubt let me know to sps embedded